Good day. In this video, we're going to explain how to calculate angles in a right angle triangle. In other words, we have right angle triangles and they provide us with two sides. Then we can work out the missing angle or angles, except the 90 degrees we already have. Before we explain these two questions, please remember that if there's anything in school mathematics that you're not sure about, you can set a WhatsApp photo of your problem to this number. Then we will try and solve your problem and send back an answer to you as soon as possible for free. In this question, they gave us a right angle triangle. They gave us the hypotenuse as 15 and they gave me a 12 over here and nothing over there. And they asked me to work out the value of x. When we solve triangles in grade 10, we use the plan. You'll see now how it works. We first write sine, cos or tan. Then we write the angle. Then we put an equal. Then we put a fraction for the ratio. I also assume that you know what Sokatua stands for. Sine is O over H, cos is A over H, and tan is O over A. Opposite hypotenuse, adjacent hypotenuse, opposite adjacent. If you stand here at X, this will be my adjacent and this will be my hypotenuse. I go into Sokatua and I see who uses A and H. And I can see here I see A and H and that is cos. So I'll write cos. Next, I will fill in the angle I'm looking for. In this case, it is the angle at C. And then I'll write in the ratio of cos from here. Then I will replace them by the numbers that I have over here. Then I'll use my calculator to solve for C. I'll push shift, cos, and then this value. Then my answer will be angle C is 36,87 degrees. This is rounding off. And they will tell me how many places I must round it off. I then always write this value in where it belongs and if they ask me I work out the remaining angle with interior angles of a triangle. I take 180 minus 90 minus this then I can write it in and if they ask me to work out this side now I will use Pythagoras with these two sides to work out the remaining side then I have all three my angles and all three the sides of the triangle solved. Here is our second question. They gave us a right angle triangle. They gave us a 90 degrees. They gave us two of the sides and they asked us to work out that angle at E. First we will write down our plan. Here we will put sine, cos or tan, the angle, equal and then the ratio. Standing at E, this is my opposite and this is my adjacent, the two they gave me. I look over here who uses O and A. Not him, not him. Yes, he uses it. So I fill in tan. Next, I fill in the angle I'm looking for, which will be E in this case. Then I fill in the ratio of tan from here, which is O over A. And then I'll fill in the right values from each of these letters here. The opposite is 4, and the adjacent is 6. Then I've got to solve for E, so I push shift, tan, 4 over 6, and I get my answer. Then the calculator will say 33. 69 degrees and I fill that in and if need be I can work out the other angle with the interior angles of a triangle by minusing these two from 180 and that'll be 56.31 degrees if I have to work out the length of this side I can just use Pythagoras look at the video about Pythagoras then I will have all three my sides and all three the sizes of my angles Please indicate whether you liked or disliked the video and subscribe to the channel.